special Hello Drama Fest. This year at Drama Fest, as you know, we had to go online. But despite that, we did not want to miss the opportunity to showcase student work from across the province. And so we adapted. And with the help of Cape Breton University and the Boardmore Theatre, we took our showcase to YouTube. Thank you so much to everyone who worked on these shows. We know how much hard work goes into a show in a regular year, so seriously, congratulations to all of you. All right, Drama Fest, let's get to it. Here at Cape Breton University, tradition never stands still. Ours is a tradition of possibility, inspiring us to become the leaders of tomorrow in creating a world we can be proud of. Ours is a tradition of new, and everyone is welcome. Sometimes she can be a bit, like, distant lately. After you left, she just became different. Yeah, she doesn't seem like herself. So something like 
like that happens, just don't take it personal. That's the answer for it. Okay. Um, what time is it? Uh, probably time for you to go to bed. <laughs> yeah, I guess you're right. Good night, Will. Good night. You should get going, too. I'm going to finish reading my book for a little bit. TV shows like 16 and Pregnant and Teen Mom, we've all become familiar with and perhaps slightly desensitized to the perils of teen pregnancy. What? In fact, to many, it may no longer seem shocking. Um, to I'm going to check on She wasn't 15. She wasn't 14. She wasn't 13. She wasn't even 12. She was 11. Yeah, you heard me right. I said that she was pregnant at 11. Now, she's 12 years old and the mother of this beautiful baby girl. And before we get started, I want to introduce all the players in this preteen fast asleep in there. Oh good. First, I'm watching. Uh Josh is up. Probably in his little baby bathroom. So, little so Will told me that he's been on this medication for a while now. Well, you know, it messes with his memory. He needs to be really conscious of it. Oh. He still hasn't really told me what he's on. The doctors are still running tests. Listen, it's no big deal. I'm kind of concerned. I want to know what's going on with Will. I do too, but Albuquerque Grace Hospital, how may I direct your call? Hi, could you please um, put Dr. Andrews on the phone, please? One moment, please. I'm sorry, there's no physician currently working at the hospital by the name of Mr. Andrews. Dr. Andrews, is there any way I may uh, assist you today? Um, could you please look up the patient Will Walker for me? Please hold. I'm sorry, there's no patient in our system by that name. May I assist you in some other way? Hello? Sorry, no, that's everything. Well, come on. Oh my God, Will, are you okay? What's going on? I'm 
Wanda, what have you done? Don't touch him. Excuse me? I know what you've been doing. What are you talking about? What's this? That's his new medication. Poison? No, I... Listen, you... Don't touch him. Oh, come on. I'm your mother. You can't just speak to me like that. I'm taking him to get the help that he needs, or doesn't need. So what, you're just going to leave me like you did before? Yes, and get him help. What was I supposed to do? You left. Not poison your son. We're leaving. Come on, Will. You can't just leave. Come on, Mom. You bitch! 